Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Okay, then. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Okay, looks like I could optimize this power relay. Nice. Okay, what next? It looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit. Finished. Signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter.
I'd call that a mild success. I'd call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... It can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Ah, uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Doc loves these things. He used them in grad school when he had to manipulate radioactive isotopes. Says seeing them keeps him humble. What is this, Doc? Never seen this type of material. Would you believe it's for welding? Provides remarkable magnetic insulation and limits cross-contamination between the neural interface and arms. Direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful... An intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Peter is starting to suspect. He hides it, but I can tell. He's seen my twitch. Noticed the decay of my fine motor control. Well... I'm the one who wanted a genius for an assistant. Of course he knows. <sighs> I just need more time. My work can improve millions of lives. Save millions of lives. It can also save my own. I just need more time. Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Thank you again, Peter. Don't know what I'd do without you. I only wish you'd told me sooner, Doc. I didn't want to burden you. And if I'm honest... 
Telling you made my condition that much more real. I was afraid. My condition is worsening, but I choose to view it as a challenge. Extra incentive to push forward. Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye! Friends, there's a fine line between being a conspiracy theorist and seeing a clear pattern. I walk that line, and I am confident in perceiving a common thread among these attacks on Oscorp and Norman Osborne by the demons. The motive? It's hard to ascribe motive to lunatics, but I suspect it's no accident that they're striking at both the pillar of our corporate community and the center of our city's government. It's our very way of life that's under assault, as I have always warned. If you've been listening to me, you're ready. If not, I'll pray for you. Hey, Pete. So this station monitors water pressure down to the individual building. Structures above four stories use water towers to augment the city's system. The idea is to identify problems before they spread, you know? Whoa. The pressure in this building's all over the map. I need to find out why. The water towers connect to the city's system at the four-story mark. I'll scan the pipes, try to see where this starts. Pipes are fine up here. Whatever's causing this, it's lower.
Here's the problem. Valve's at the wrong setting. Easy enough to fix. That shouldn't have happened. I better seal these fast before Jameson pins it on me. Call me the Amazing Spider Plumber. Et voila. Even better than duct tape. Got it. All fixed. Just in time. Nailed it. Got it. Last one. Those won't hold long. Pressure shouldn't be that high. Unless the drainage is blocked. I'll check the outlet pipe. The outlet pipe's down by the waterfront. I'll go see if anything's blocking it. other heroes fight crime and fix your shower. And now Oscorp can't deny Harry's station stopped a public utility meltdown. Hey, turn this way. Shouldn't you be swinging or something? Hey there. Spider crisis coming through. Be quick. Bombs could go off any second. Okay, took care of that one. close to perfection. What are you doing here? Oh, we got a fighter. 
You just made your last mistake, punk. What the? Does it seriously take this many guys to rob a teenager? Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros. Okay? Uh, okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time. But when I do it, I have... Oh, oh like that time you fought Rhino on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. <laughs> The other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's it's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing, don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet, and when they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jaw. Okay? I can. <clears throat> oh, sh. S sorry. No, no. No. It's all good. <laughs> you keep that up, and uh, you'll be fine. All right. Lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey, uh. Thanks. You know. Anytime. Just punch Spider Man. Shelter should be just ahead. Yo, Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you suck. He totally would have bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Uh, cool. Later. Farmer's market. I can cut through there. Keep moving, keep Man. moving. Hope they're okay. I'm not the guy in charge. Just head up two blocks. Right? Cut Sorry, through there. I can't let you pass. Come on, no picture. Just keep moving. What's up today? No, no, can't let you through. I can't believe you're saying this right by the way. Lucky, oh, come on, get over here. When you say it like that, how would you say it? Tourism's down. There are opportunities to be had. Like half off at decadent huh. Hacking it. I wonder okay. if it still works. Kidding me? It's gonna take forever. The drone wasn't watching. I could jump the fence. He just needs to isolate the drone signal. Wow, that was too easy. I can't believe Sable systems are unsecured. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip.
Okay, hacking app. Don't fail me now. Okay. Okay, time to move. <clears throat> okay, let's see. I can go under the gate on the left, or over the scaffolding to the right. Scaffolding will work. Oh, more drones? Gotta blind them. You're blind. We have footage. Oh, man, I just gotta go home. I have the authority to arrest and detain you. I haven't stopped them first. Just let me... Are you ready to... Those things have mounted guns? Oh, can't let them spot me. So cool, it was less terrifying. Come on, ignore me. I'm invisible. <clears throat> okay. I'm in the clear. Phew. That was intense. Oh, hey, Mom. Hi, honey. Did you make it to the feast shelter okay? Uh, yeah. Almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. But this is mine. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. Oh, honey. I love you so much. We'll get through this. Okay? I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. You know what? Just, oh, just keep breathing. Right. I'll be back soon, Mr. Punch. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no. I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um, what can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place? Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of... Protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic. It fits. Good one, kid. I'm a piece of junk. <laughs> oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Huh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these CR when they're... CR what, what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Got the time. Get it. Go! Or... Could be a loose coax cable. <laughs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. 
Hey, new kid. I'm empty here. Rio and son Miles, as well as brother Aaron. In addition to the hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Uh, listen, Cat, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. See if Aunt May needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. I'm afraid our computers are a bit outdated. Oh, that's cool. I might be able to improve their performance for you. Really? That would be extremely helpful. Thank you. Peter, be careful out there. Miles told me the Sable patrols are being very strict. Hey, is it okay if I get here late on Thursdays? That's when the robotics club meets. Absolutely. Your education comes first. May told me about your parents and Uncle Ben. Sorry I snapped at you at the funeral. All good, Miles. Hey, if you ever want to talk, I'm here. So how's it going with your daughter, Eileen? Slow. I made mistakes raising her. Hard to get past. If you're talking, there's hope. Don't give up. Now that's a wise man right there. Hey, Pete. Your aunt's really stepped up. Yeah, she's the best. Sandman and said, this is a shelter. There's nothing to steal. Get out. And he did. What? That is awesome. <laughs> You've got some pretty cool stories, Mrs. P. Peter, Miles says he can connect all the feast shelters on one network. said you turned down a job at Oscorp to work at a startup. Much respect. I warned him about the Illuminati.
Gotta get out of here before my kids find out. Pete, I'm gonna be fine. You're worse than my mom. Miles has had it rough. Sometimes that means you don't want anyone's help, but you still need it. Speaking from experience? Thanks to your aunt, I got a job at the Coffee Bean. Turns out, if I remember not to curse, I'm pretty good with people. I could have told you that. Way to go, Gloria. Hey, Yuri. I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what's she gonna do? Shoot me? Honestly, 50-50 chance. Ah, uh, fine. I'll be in the neighborhood, but not too close. Just in case. City. What's our worst case scenario? Uh, you know, global pandemic, end of the world, that kind of thing. Why did I even ask? 